Today I'm gonna try to fix this old and noisy DC motor. It sounds pretty scratchy. I think I found the problem. The rotor and the magnets are very close together and they might be rubbing. I think I can give this motor a little upgrade. This is the new housing I designed in 3D Builder. The vents on the sides are for a fan I'm gonna add to the rotor. I took it out of its original housing after it was running and it was very hot to the touch. I put the rotor in the bottom part of the motor and now I'm stuffing that into the new 3D printed motor housing. It is finally built after struggling to keep this whole setup together without it falling apart. Looks good. The motor housing including the rotor is resting on a permanent magnet. I will slowly increase the voltage using a 3 to 12 volt power supply. It works! This motor is starting to get fast. It's running off at 12 volts and it's going very fast. I got a bit of a problem here. The friction caused by the shaft is melting my motor housing. I'll try to fix this problem. I am gonna extract the bearing from an old broken computer fan. I'm gonna somehow make the shaft hole bigger on my 3D printed housing. And I'm gonna stuff the bearing into it. There's gonna be a lot less friction. I stuffed the bearing into the hole that I made bigger by friction melting the case with a vacuum cleaner motor. It is finally completely assembled. I made sure the bearing won't come out by using hot glue. Let's test from 3 to 12 volts. This time with a little less friction. Can't really start itself at 3 volts. Increasing voltage. There is wind coming out of my motor. I see some sparks in the inside. That's where the brushes come in contact with the rotor. My 3D printed motor housing is a success. Please like and subscribe if you thought that was interesting.